No, that is not your mom calling for you when dinner is ready. Those are holler monkeys. And in this Mexican jungle, I'm gonna lift some logs to see what animals I can find. Let's get started. There is something under there. At first, I thought it was some kind of dog. But upon further research, turns out, it's not a dog. I don't know if this millipede is harmful. So maybe I should have thought of that before I put it on my hand. Too late now. Apparently it doesn't like my hand, which is understandable because you don't know where the thing has been. I'm just gonna let him go now. It's time to lift log number two. Ooh, termites. Those are pretty cool, especially because of their diet. They eat mostly wood. And no, I'm not going to make the same joke again. They eat wood, just like your mom. Damn it. You know when people tell you that a Lego is the worst thing to step on? Well, those people clearly haven't stepped on a landmine before. And this jungle is full of biological landmines, like venomous spiders and snakes. So I have to be careful where I step. At first it looks like nothing is underneath lock number 3. That is because the animal that is under there can teleport. These are whip spiders. And they are fast. Very fast. I like these spiders so much. Because one moment they're there. And the next moment they're gone and you don't know if they're on you or not. So fun. I didn't even have to lift the lock to see this one tap dance, but keep watching, especially under lock number 5, I find something crazy. But first, lock number 4. Do you see the animal? This is another millipede, but another species than before. It isn't doing much, so poke it. At this point I was serving as a fly through for mosquitoes, and then I became fast food because I was running out of the jungle. Unfortunately, I still had to return to the jungle to collect my balls. Because at this point, I had sweated those off. What I found under log number 5 is crazy. That is one ugly animal. Log number 6 had something cool. This is a pretty big species of beetle. But since it's just a beetle, it should be safe to handle. I thought. Surprisingly, painful bites. Too late now, but lucky for me, she was pretty chill. It's a shame it wasn't a male, because those are really cool. But now it's time to let her go again. Always make sure you don't crush the animal by putting the log back. What I found on the log number 7 was a surprise for me. At first I thought it was a snail. But as a biologist I can tell you, snails don't pinch you like this one does. This is a hermit crab, and I was surprised to find this in a jungle. We were closer to the ocean now, that is probably why I found this one here. This one was pretty shellfish, because it didn't want to get filmed. Or it probably wanted to get away from my stupid jokes. So I covered him back up and left him alone. Now it was time to really get out of the jungle. Stick to the end, because I got a great video for you lined up in the end screen. First I want to thank all patrons and everyone that watched. I think you'll like this video next. Thank you.